Uh, Terry, exhibition game, obviously, but would it be fair to call that a, a wake-up call? Uh, maybe. Uh, you know, defensively, we're uh, first quarter, we got off to a uh, poor start. We uh, looked a little disorganized. Uh, it was very disappointing. Uh, I do think Denver took advantage uh, with some good passing and some good shot making, but uh, very disappointed with our defenses uh, this game. Um, you know, statistically, the second and third quarter weren't bad, uh, but the, the deficit never really changed. But uh, yeah, we didn't play well. We didn't play well at either end, and it's, uh, and it's disappointing. I don't know if wake up call, but you know, we got a game, we got a regular season game in a week. So uh, I think uh, we understand there's some things that we got to get better at. Were you concerned about your energy level coming out? No, uh, no, I don't think so. Um, uh, no, that didn't, that's not what crossed my mind is more, um, I think it's more just positioning and, um, you know, reading and communicating. I wouldn't, I wouldn't necessarily call it effort. Aaron Fentress, the Oregonian. Were the mistakes things you hadn't seen in practice or were they the result of stuff Denver was doing? Cause you said last or a couple of days ago that you expected to get different types of tests from this team. So were you seeing things maybe you hadn't worked on and just weren't able to adapt? Uh, well, I knew going into this game that it was going to be a good test of our defense because of, uh, you know, primarily because of Jokic and, you know, he's so unique in what he's able to do passing and scoring the ball on the perimeter. Uh, and they've got some great, great perimeter guys. They, they move well without the ball. Um, they can, if you overextend your defense, uh, they can take advantage of it with back doors and, and cuts. So we knew going into this game that it would be, uh, it would be a challenge, uh, particularly out without necessarily a, a game plan scouting report going into it. So, um, and, you know, they did the things that they're good at particularly in the first quarter. I do think we got better uh, in the second and third quarter, but um, knowing Denver and how they play, it was going to be tough. Thanks. Joe Becker, K2. Uh, Terry, you mentioned that you have less than a week before your first game. Uh, you've only been practicing about a week because of how things were going. How would you uh, evaluate how the teams progressed in the first week of training? Well, um, you know, obviously, uh, after our, our first ex, uh, preseason game, um, I think everybody's pretty excited. But the uh, last two games have been uh, been disappointing, and we're not there yet. It's uh, this is going to be. I've said this before. This season is going to be one. Uh, I think the better teams are going to be the ones that continue to improve because the lack of uh, training camp and preparation time going into the season. So um, that's where we got to. Everybody wants to come out of the gate really well, but there's uh, there's improvement. Every team is going to need to get better uh, going into the season. Do you have one concern uh, that's the priority for you? Um, well, it's certainly at the defensive end. You know, I, we didn't mm -hmm. shoot the ball well tonight. We didn't necessarily have a good offensive game, but I think we've shown over the years that we uh, we're going to be a good offensive team. So the concern is defense and doing some things differently uh, in a short amount of time is, is challenging. So that, that would be my concern. Got it. Thank you. Casey Holdall, trailblazers.com. Uh, Terry, I'm sure you're, you're not happy with any part of your defense, but particularly three point defense is something you, you've talked about before. And tonight, uh, 19 of 46, they got up a lot. They made a lot. Uh, how, how would you kind of categorize that and, and the work that needs to be done on that, that perspective? Well, that is concerning. Uh, Sacramento shot a lot of threes. Uh, Denver shot a lot of threes. So um, that is a concern. And uh, But one of the things we've really wanted to emphasize, probably a bigger concern was in the first half, they were 14 for 15 at, at the rim. So, you know, we can't, we can't give up threes and give up the rim. And so our emphasis on, on weak side help, we may give up some more threes, but we can't give up the rim too.